Hi, this is Cheryl with Peace and Power Movement Services. I'm here today with another movement exploration. As often, these come at um, from a request from a client. So working recently with a client on, you know, the computer slump, right? We're working over the computer. Sometimes you have a job where you literally have to put your laptop onto your knees and work on the computer. And so, you know, that posture when we times it by two hours, three hours, four hours, can really start to have an effect on the shape of your spine, how you can do posture, and what might start to wear out or get tight, particularly this, this sort of triangle zone, um, your neck between your shoulder blades. It really has to hold on when you're holding yourself in that position. So couple little explorations. So first of all, I want to give you a sensory experience of what it's like to have your spine doing this kind of lift up through its length. Um, so coming into lying on your back, having your feet on the surface and pressing into your feet so that you're starting to bring your pelvis up but more noticing what that does to the length of your head, that it, you're sending your head along the surface, creating this longer uplift of your spine. So I just wanted you to feel this movement so that you can relocate it if it, if it feels a bit distant um, in your day-to-day -day computer slumping habit. But the movement exploration I wanted to focus on, having you lie on your side, making soft fists, bringing one fist up, and then exploring what needs to happen. You know, imagining that you have magnets in your hand and you're, you're gonna both repel them. So one goes back and up and one goes forward. And then they they attract each other, so they're coming closer together. Now, the, the trick of this is to do two things. Put your mind into the magnets, into your fists, so that you can really start to feel this effect, rather than sort of mindlessly moving your arms up and down. And then the other is to have a sense of that lengthening of your spine as your hands are repulsed from each other, as they move farther away, so that you can feel this kind of lengthening up and through you as you bring your hands close together or as you expand them apart. This is the sort of exercise that when people say, what should I do about something about poor posture? Well, the simple answer is we need to be more aware of ourselves in our body. I offer these kinds of explorations because they give you a sense of a quality of how your spine can kind of rotate and lift through you. Once you have a sense of that, you can bring that into this quality of, I'm working on my laptop on my lap, and I can bring this kind of uplift, this kind of lifting through without it being a tightening, kind of like good soldier sort of posture, just that you're lifting up so that then you can do the work you need to, look the way you need to, but without kind of giving up your whole spine, your whole torso towards slouching over the computer. So I hope this was helpful for you. Uh, take good care and have a great movement day.